from Kenner's Star Wars The Empire Strikes Back collection, it's Tauntaun. My mission is urgent. Tauntaun has removable reins and saddle. Action figures each sold separately. Hey, old rebel soldier. Han Solo, help. Luke Skywalker is in danger. Tauntaun's front and hind legs move. Luke's okay. I found him. Our mission's complete. Tauntaun from Star Wars The Empire Strikes Back collection. Action figures each sold separately from Kenner. <laughs> Hello and welcome to Flashback Star Wars Obsessed. In this episode, I will be talking about the vintage Kenner Tauntaun. The indispensable snow lizard known as a Tauntaun serves as a sturdy mount for the many rebels who need personal modes of transportation for reconnaissance missions on the ice planet of Hoth. Hardy beasts, the omnivorous Tauntauns are reptile mammals. Like Rancor, Wampa, and possibly Rodians like Greedo, a class of animal possessing both mammalian and reptilian traits. The Tauntaun is an animal whose skin is covered in scales, yet these scales are further coated with shaggy fur, and so at first glance, many assume they are mammals. However, they lack mammary glands entirely, and although they engage in live childbirth, for their newborn young, they regurgitate a substance similar to milk, which is produced in their crops. The single most essential trait of the Tauntaun is its highly unusual blood, fueled by the animal's four nostrils, which allow the bees to both warm inhaled air and also oxygenate the blood during moments of physical duress. A Tauntaun's blood is constructed of a unique mixture that allows the creature to keep its organs from freezing solid, while also affording the species a high level of resistance to the planet's absolutely brutal winds. Kenner released the original Tauntaun in 1980, which was indispensable to anyone wanting to stage Hoth-based adventures. With movable front hind legs and featuring a trap door in back that fits most action figures, collectors could relive the Rebel Alliance's most important patrol, Han Solo searching for Luke Skywalker. And here is my Tauntaun figure that I've had since the late 80s. This was another um, piece of my collection that was given to me by a friend that I had at the time who decided to give up his whole Star Wars collection to me. Wasn't that awesome? He didn't even ask for any money. He was just done with Star Wars and gave it all to me. At the time, he took care of it. You know, I took very good care of it since I had it from him, but this looks really good. Uh, there's nothing broken, although I think the reins may have been broken. It looks like it's split here as they're common to do um, and glued together, you know, and there's a bit of yellowing because of age. I don't know, but it looks good. The legs move just fine. The buckle looks great. The, the door here functions perfectly. I like that Kenner built in, I guess they could say the universal leg design for any figure to sit. Look like the figure sitting on the Tauntaun. It's a really well designed figure. Let's see, you have a Luke figure here. See how easy it goes into the inside. Well, it doesn't go in that easily because his legs are spread apart. So you gotta push his legs together. Then, okay, then push in, and there he goes. Fits just fine. Years later, I had gotten another Tauntaun. Honestly, I can't remember how I got this, but maybe I got it in a lot of figures because I was that's what I was doing for a while, just buying lots of figures. And unfortunately, this did not come with the reins, but it looks good. You know, the buckle, unfortunately. Oh. Huh. Interesting, the buckle are applied differently. This one actually looks better because the, the strap is underneath, so it hides it. But this one, as you can see, unfortunately broken right there but it sticks out like this. That's way better. I'm wondering if the 
previous owner of this had removed it, could figure out how to buckle it together. But other than that, everything else looks good and it stands just fine. All right, let's see how Han can go in here. And the, yep, it works just fine. Looking good. My two Tauntaun figures from the Empire Strikes Back Vintage Kenner Collection. All right, it's the Vintage Kenner Tauntaun figure. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and click subscribe. You can check out my other videos here and here. You can follow me at Instagram and Facebook. See you on the next Flashback Star Wars Obsessed.